Hey guys, I'm here to review Drive and Jump. Now this is a pretty old school type of game, one of those that's pretty pixelated. So we're gonna go right into it so you guys can see what it's all about. So, um, the game basically, the controllers are pretty easy. All you're doing is moving your iPad side to side. Okay, so I'm just gonna reopen the app. Cause it's kinda lagging right now for some reason. Um, but that's just my airplay, don't worry about the app itself, it doesn't lag. There's no reason why it should lag anyway, since it's a really, really basic app. Uh, the graphics, you will not be impressed by them. But then again, that's the type of game that this is going for, a really old school type of thing, where everything's pixelized. Anyways, um, the game to play, all you're doing is moving your iPad, your whole iPad or your iPhone, from side to side, okay? So this game's available for both iPad, iPhone and iPod Touch. Okay, I don't recommend it for iPad since uh, everything looks way too huge, way too huge for iPad. Um, so it is, basically everything looks way, way too big on iPad. I actually get a little bit nauseous just playing it on my iPad for some reason. If you guys are not getting nauseous by looking at it right now um, on the screen, you won't get nauseous, okay? It might just be me, okay? Uh, but the colors and the whole thing, I don't know, it's getting me nauseous. Um, and what I'm doing to just drive it, okay? You're just moving your iPad side to side, okay? So the car goes to side to side, so right to left. And then you're just jumping by pressing, well, tapping anywhere on the screen, okay? So you do need to jump the, um, these things right here, okay, the bridges. So you do need to jump those. And you can jump any of these cars as well, okay? Now the game itself, not too exciting, I have to say. Um, would I recommend it? No. Would I give it a 3 out of 10? Yes. And why? Because it's making me nauseous. Other than that, it's an okay game, I guess. Um, if you like old school type of games, this is the game for you. If you don't and you get nauseous easily by these colors and graphics that are way too huge for iPad, um, this is not the game for you, okay? So, there's not much more I can say about the game since I'm not too excited about it. I haven't done too many levels or anything like that. Um, it's not the easiest game, it's not the hardest either, but... Um, once again, the green with the red just doesn't go with me. Um, the, the game itself, it's a little bit too big for iPads. So once again, I don't recommend it for iPad. Um, for iPhone, I can see it pretty well. I mean, since everything's huge on your iPhone, it'll look fine. Um, however, for iPad, it doesn't. So once again, just because it makes me nauseous, I'm gonna have to give it a 3 out of 10. And also because I just don't like it. Um, once again, this is one of those type of games, like every, almost every other game, that you can share on Twitter and Facebook your scores and compete against other people. Obviously, that's a way to advertise the game. Um, so a lot of gamers and uh, game developers implement Facebook and Twitter into the games. So this is one of those games, and uh, that, that's a good thing, it's always good to have uh, that option, okay? You don't necessarily have to sign into your Facebook or Twitter in order to play the game, so that's good. Same thing for uh, data or Wi-Fi connection, you don't need it to play the game, so that's good too. Um, and that's about it guys for this game. If you guys would like me to review any games out there, no matter what the price is, just uh, leave your comment right here below in the comments area also for any issues that you guys might have with anything to do with your iPhones or iPads just once again right here in the comments area and don't forget to subscribe and rate and once again comments area that's where you have to ask all your questions and you can ask me to review any game or give you just an overview, maybe not even talk, but give you an overview of what the game's about. Anyways, that's it for this. If you guys have any comments, questions, ask here below, and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.